All right. We're live now. Oh, we're live now. Sorry, guys. Hi, it's Candice Cruz for Pageant Live, and we are here with Judge Laura Brown. Hi. <laughs> right. Hi. Oh, I love your dress. Thank you. It's Mark Jacobs. Uh, he did a collection um, for spring that was like madly patriotic. It was all about Americana, and it was so great. And I mean, I, I was asked to do this. I was like, that's my dress. It's oh. Uncle, what do I call it? Uncle Samantha. Yeah, Uncle Samantha. Yeah, Uncle Samantha. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Well, what are you most excited about for the competition going into it? I'm really, I'm really excited to see. Firstly, no, I'll tell you. Why I'm, firstly, I'm excited that it's no longer owned by Trump, that it's bought by IMG. I think that um, I think it's being incrementally pushed forward. I'm really, it's really important to me that women are represented well and they are confidently beautiful. Um, but I really think that's that's key. And I think coming from what, where I am a magazine and the job that I have, it's very important to me that, that I recognize a, a great, cool, smart, impressive woman. And, and if she happens to look great in a swimsuit, that's great. It's not my priority. And I don't think, you know, I think that should be the last priority. I think it should be. Do you have any girls you're looking forward to seeing whenever you go out there? I have no idea. I have not looked at anybody. No, I didn't want to know. I was like, I know it's like it's cut down from the original ones. I know I want to meet everybody on the level. When they when they get here, so no, I don't want to I don't want to color my my perceptions, yeah. And then, what's your favorite part of competition? Interview part, yeah, interview part. I think that it's uh, you know, I think it's not obviously they're difficult questions, but I don't I don't think the intention is to like stitch anyone up. It's uh, but you have to show, and if it's the only way, frankly, within three categories that you can show your your brain, then then let's do it. So, what is the one question you would want to ask the future Miss USA? The future Miss USA, I, if I could, and no, actually, actually, it was asked Miss Universe last year, and I'm glad it was. Uh, would be, how do you feel? Do you feel comfortable with the sim swimsuit element of this competition? Yes or no? I'm just curious. I'm hardly like Gloria Steinem, but I'm just curious about that. So, but I'm doing a political one. Can you give us a sneak peek? Just about voting and maybe who it might be for. No, I'm just. I'd love it if somebody goes Bernie. No, I'm kidding. Oh, just, just plug, just plug whoever you want. Just go up there. No, 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 no. I mean, like the contestant. Would be Wouldn't crazy, it be so like, funny? If, like, it's like the the contestant is like a crazy, like lefty. It'd be so great. I don't expect it, but it'd be funny. Yeah. Well, thank you so much, and <laughs> and enjoy the pageant. Thank, thank you so you. much. Exactly. Of course. Having a koala. <laughs> thank you. Okay. Okay. Hey, can we grab you? Hi, Cami. Yeah. Okay, wonderful. I can be, I have Cami Crawford. We're just gonna keep going live, guys. So thank you so much for joining us at Pageant Live. Of course, hello. You are absolutely fabulous. Thank I'm you. assuming Sherry Hill. Of course. Can we see? Can you do like a little spin for us? Oh, that's amazing. <laughs> now I know you were 2010. Yes. And you have a lot of stuff going on. I've seen you on TV doing interviews, yeah. and you've got a new show coming out. Tell me a little bit about yes. that. Yes. Okay. So the show is called F and Fabulous. It premieres June 28th on BET. And it surrounds three of my closest friends and I in New York City. It's 20-somethings living in the city, working hard to build their own empires. It's like Sex in the City and Empire merge. And it was so much fun to make. And it's like I got to be myself, which was the best part about it. It was just so cool and so much fun. How would you define your empire that you've like built since 2010? Because it's been six years now. Yeah. Like, How do you define your Wow, it's kind of like a hodgepodge. Like, whatever I want to do, I just do it. So I'm a television host, but I'm also a working model. But I also just started my own lifestyle brand, and it's called Knox, and it's coming out probably right after the show. I haven't set like a official launch date, but I'm starting with sleep teas, and I have some stuff dedicated to my pageant girls, of course. And it's just been exciting. Like I just want to do whatever I want to do, because I can. Why not? <laughs> this is the time to do it, right? Right. Amazing. Do you have any favorites going into the competition? <laughs> well, well, <laughs> you know, just, I would to not be, but like they hired me to be a red carpet host, so I'm like not biased, so I can't be biased. Well, since you've been on stage before, what is going through your mind right before you're going on stage? Like, what are these girls going through right now? There's a lot of nerves. I just talked to some of the girls backstage for like five minutes, and I was just like, have fun with it, because they're like so, they're like studying their questions for what might be asked in the top five question, and like, just have a good time. You don't know what they're going to ask. And at the end of the day, you prepared for this. So don't second guess yourself. Just go for it. And what's the best advice for the new title holder, the new Miss USA? Ooh. Take lots of pictures. Print them out. Like, I know that's such, like, an archaic idea, but, like, print out the photos. Because all my photos are on Facebook, but I don't actually have, like, a set designated place. And you forget all the things that you've done. Um, and take every day for what it is and, like, really make your year what it is that you want it to be. Because it's all up to you. 
Thank you so much, Cammy, And best of luck. When does your show air so we can watch it? June 28th on BET at 10 p.m. <laughs> You'll be sure to watch. Thank you. And that's it. That was Cammie Crawford for Pageant Live.